So we've got a big pile of boxes. And on the top is a five kilogram box, a two, a four, a three, and an eight. And the idea here is we're going to take this one off the top and we're going to put it in one of the bins. And each bin, that's my bin one, here's my bin two, and here's my bin three. Each of these can take, fit a maximum of 10. So you take this five and you put it in the first one available. There it is. That one's done. Now here comes a two and we'll stick that one in there as well. Two done. Now the four doesn't fit in this one here, so you put that in the next one there, and that goes there, so there's the four. But the three, the three does. So we'll put the three in the first bin there, and that's that one done. The eight won't fit in there, it'll have to have its own box to itself. And so there's our answer there. So the bin one has got, a, um, let's put this in the right order actually. Uh, bin one is five, two, three. Bin two is just a four and bin three is just an eight. But you can do it in a different way. Um, instead of doing that, what you could do is rearrange these and put them in the what's called the first fit decreasing. And so what we do is pick up all these boxes and just rearrange them. So we put the eight first, then the five, then the four, then the three, then the two. And we do exactly the same thing again. This time you start with the eight in bin one. Actually, I'm not going to draw my diagrams this time. I think you can cope without a picture this time. So bin one, the eight goes in, but the five won't fit in. So we'll put that in bin two. The four won't go in there, but it will go in there. The three won't go in there or in there. So the three needs to have its own bin all of itself. And the two, yep, the two would actually fit in that first one. So using a first fit decreasing algorithm, you get them in slightly different order. Why might that not be a good idea? Well, it's a simple practical issue that these boxes were all here. This one was basically at the bottom of all of these other things. And really to rearrange them all might have taken more effort than it was worth. Simply it's that. Part D says, well, if each bin could only hold eight, is it possible to still pack them into Pack the bosses, I think it means boxes, um, to pack the boxes into three bins. Of course it is. All we'd do is we'd take that one and put it in there, and that one and put it in there. So you could have eight, you could have five and two, and you could have three and four. So there, there's an example of how it would definitely be possible. You know it wouldn't fit in two because the grand total of this is more than 16. Um, but there.